to the So What's On My iPhone video. As you can see here, I have the iPhone 6S, not the plus, just the regular one. Um, it's in gray. I don't know if it's space gray or whichever gray, but it's gray. And it's got the OtterBox commuter case on it because I was giving up on the like really pretty cases and I just decided to commit to an OtterBox and hopefully keeps my phone safe. And so far it has. The screen's a little bit dirty. Do you have a screen protector on it? So we're just going to get started when you... Let up my phone. There's a picture of my dog and he was laying on my lap. I saw it was the cutest thing ever. And I do have it so that it's touch ID, which is probably one of the greatest things ever for me. But yeah, so let's get started. So we have the basic apps, texting, um, texting, calendar, photo, camera. Um, then I, it starts my kind of apps in this folder and this is called my finance folder. And so in here I have Credit Karma, Capital One, and USA. The next one is my travel folder, which these are for work, and this is United, Jet Setter, American, and Marriott. Um, then it goes to weather, camera. This is just a random folder, like it doesn't even have a name. But it's where I keep the app store and like my videos. And my dog is lying like right on my bed. Um, Starbucks app. Oh, live, breathe by it. Settings, Google Maps, I keep that on the front page because I'm always getting lost. iTunes Store, my photography folder, which is probably like one of my favorite folders. Open that up. Got Instagram, Diptych, Camera Plus, Perfect Photo, Facetune, Snapchat, Afterlight, Perfect 365, Edit Lab, uh, Visco? I don't know if that's how you say that. Um, wallet is randomly in there, I don't really know why, but that's where I ended up. Airbrush, Pinterest. FX Studio and Play Memories, and the Play Memories is for my um, Samsung camera, not Samsung, we're talking about Sony camera, so that I can get my pictures to my phone from my camera. And so all the other ones are like editing and basic photo apps. Next we have my health apps here. So I haven't opened this folder in a while, which is really bad, but I have daily yoga, fitness buddy, 7 minute workouts, uh, yoga studio, lose it, uh, that's period tracker, <laughs> pacer, and the health app that comes with Apple. Um, by far, I'm in love with yoga studio, it's absolutely amazing, and whenever I go on a diet, I use lose it to count my calories and what's not. Then after that, you have news, I have my social media, um, notes, Fiverr, and um, that's like my business kind of apps, we don't really go into that one. But for social media, I have uh, Skype, Vine, Facetune and OkCupid, okay, but I really don't go on any of those other than Vine, and Vine's not even like social, so it's yeah. No, it's Fiverr. Everybody knows that. And my business apps, um, business apps are just Shopify and QuickBooks. That's why I keep my phone. If you go to the next page, I have three page worth, four. I don't really know. Um, random extras I don't really go to because my calculator just slide up for it. My shopping, so I have Whole Look, Fab, Etsy. Joann's, Amazon, Amazon videos in there, it really shouldn't be, but what else? Chuckle 51, Ebates, Target, Cartwheel, um, eBay, Snip Snap. Snip Snap is awesome if you guys need coupons for like anywhere. You can pretty much find one on Snip Snap. Um, PayPal, Nordstrom, Wallapop, which honestly I haven't really used, and The Goods, which is the home goods app where you can see all the really awesome stuff that people bought. So then I have the podcast app that I don't use. I have my entertainment folder, which has Netflix, Pandora, iHeartRadio, iBooks, Hulu, and BuzzFeed. Um, I don't know why. Like I feel like some people don't use iBooks, but I use it like when I have PDFs that I get from online. I just put it in my iBooks so I can read it. Um, then I have productivity folder, which self-created, like create itself. It's got reminders and stocks. I don't look at that. Um, another business folder. This is like for applying for jobs. So Indeed and Glassdoor. And then I have my games folder, which has Traffic Rush, Heads Up, Free Flow, Trivia Crack, um, Tum Tum, I think that's what it's called. I'm not really cool. Sure. Or Two Simi Two I don't really know. Geocaching, Pop the Lock, Word Bubbles, Zombie Duck Hunt. I don't know. There's a bunch of random games in there. Uno, Sudoku, Jelly Squish, and then Pick Stool. There's a few random games in there. I don't know. I don't play a lot of them, but when they come up for free, I'm like, oh, that's something to do. And I have a navigation folder, which I keep Uber, uh, Waze, and Maps in. I don't particularly like Apple Maps, so I always go to Google Maps first, and then I go to Waze, depending on where I'm going. If 
find my iPhone a QR reader. I haven't used really either of those. My video folder, so I have YouTube Studio, I have iMovie, I have the YouTube, Fly, UVE, and Capture. So a lot of these are video editing apps. In case I shoot on my phone, I can edit on my phone as well. Next folder is, it says productivity, but really it's just more random stuff. Um, I think the only thing I actually added on here was Microsoft Word, and I still feel like I never used it. So it's just heading in there, garage band, numbers, pages, so on and so forth. Zulu, uh, Zulu, I think is what it's called. I just like looking at houses all the time. I never move, well wait, I never pick a house on there, but like, I move all the time. But I just, I, don't, I like the app a lot. WebMD, because I'm constantly looking up symptoms, like if you guys can't tell right now, I'm stuffy and sick, whatevs. Um, ADP, because I always forget my password. My Verizon, Urban Dictionary. Contrary to belief, I know very little slang, but Urban Dictionary helps me out a lot. Um, there's Google app, MapQuest, which I probably should move to my navigation folder. I just added this on there. I kind of just liked MapQuest online, so I decided to add it to my phone. And then the Southwest app. And then I have Park Mobile, because if you live in like the DMV area, or I don't know if I have it in New York, but you can pay for your parking from your phone. So I thought that was awesome. And homes, because once again, I still like looking at houses a lot. This is a random like website. I don't even know what the website is anymore. I don't know. Oh, it's business plan. Okay, that works. My watch app, which I don't have an Apple Watch, so I really have no need for that. White noise, Quizlet, Bing, and some virtual reality apps because, um, yeah, virtual reality. It's cool. But the white noise app is pretty awesome. Sometimes it works. Most of the time it doesn't work for me. But I kind of just like it. I like to hear the fireplace crackling. And then the normal apps at the bottom, phone, email, uh, Safari, and music. So that's honestly all my apps. I thought this was going to take a lot longer, but it didn't. If you guys like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and comment down below if there's anything else that I can make for you guys. See you guys later. Bye!